how do we wash our engines? How many people wash their engines? Okay, so. Hey, that's, I was going to ask you about that. Simple green. Simple green. Once again, we're back to temperature. Cold. Ice cold. Got to be. Got to be ice cold. And bag your alternator. Make sure you take a, a small shopping bag, put it over the top of the alternator, okay? And make sure you don't get water in that alternator too much. I mean, yeah, it can take a little bit, but you don't want to just garden hose the damn thing. How about all the electronics? They're all water sealed, and that's the important point, and you may bring up a very good one. The electronics and the electrical wiring that's underneath in that engine compartment is all watertight. Okay, because of the seals they put in the wiring, because of the way that they put gaskets around the control modules and things. Now, that does not give you the right to go in there with a pressure washer. <laughs> what I will tell you is that I literally go in here. I'll take this as it sits right now. I will go in, I'll spray down the entire engine compartment, get it nice and wet. I'll let it sit for about five minutes, then I will take a simple garden hose, and I will lightly spray over the top and wash all of it down. Done. That done. That simple. Yeah, I spray the motor first and then simple green and then you rinse it. Yeah. Very simple. Very, very simple. And then once you get it down there, just let it drain, let it dry, and when you take your first road test, it'll dry out nice. Because the engine heat will warm everything away. And it'll be that simple. So just bag the alternator, that's it. That's all bag the alternator, yeah. The alternator is the only thing, yeah. Yeah, yeah.